Welcome back to another episode. I know it's been a very long time since I've uh, uploaded anything, but this seemed upload worthy. So as you know, for years and years now, and I've been carrying a Glock 22 40 cal. There she is. So one of the issues that has become an issue over the years is that initially when I bought this I said I wanted to go heavy I wanted to go full size same style that the police in my city use um, it had great benefits of being able to uh, take the barrel out and switch it over to a nine millimeter I don't know if you guys know that or not but you can do that and uh, yeah I've been carrying it around and it's it's been getting heavier as you know I've added the TLR 1s and um, you know I just it just feels big and bulky everyone in my neighborhood says damn it's big it's big you know a lot of guys are wearing 30 round extended mags and guns that are a lot smaller than this um, maybe a few guys have something this size but this is a full-size Glock and it's about to be summer again maybe my what sixth or seventh summer with this thing and I wanted to go with something appendix carry a little bit smaller a little bit more nimble uh, so we recently grabbed a modest little Taurus G2C and uh, you know it's small you could definitely see the size difference there yeah see that much smaller even the grip I'm barely getting my pinky on the bottom of this thing uh, it needs some upgrades so here very soon we're gonna ditch the 12 shot mag for at least the 15 I thought about the 17 but at least the 15 which should extend the handle say at least as long as the Glock and uh, you know I always got to keep a light on all of my weapons so we're gonna go same brand TLR but we're gonna get the 7a so it'll be a TLR 7A. And an interesting thing I learned about these is you can actually mount an optic right here. You know, like a red dot optic. So that's what I intend to do. I'm gonna put a red dot optic and I'm hoping that that works out okay because with all that going on, it's probably still gonna start reaching the weight of Angel here. Yes, that's her name. And uh, I haven't given this one a name yet, but I'd like to carry it, you know, appendix carry. I'm making hamburger helper, by the way. Don't mind me, I'm in my truck. But I'd like to carry this appendix carry with a shirt over it as opposed to on the side like I've been doing that way I can up and go straight to work if God forbid I ever have to go to work in that way but I'd like to carry it here and I don't know how that optic is going to look with the 15 round mag and the TLR 7A and I've, I've got this fear of shooting my dick off too but this one has a safety, a physical safety. So, yeah, that's what we've been doing. Got me some nice. This, this is. These are actually these. Uh, what do they call these? Uh, high speed gear. These were actually for the Glock. When I carry the Glock, I've got another magazine. This is one of the magazines. I don't like extended mags, 30 rounds and all of that. I don't really. It's goofy to me. I like to keep everything concealed and quiet. But I uh, bought this. That would give me 45. 
Um, so I'll probably buy an extra set for this one. I don't really mind if people see this, although I don't want them to see it. I do care if people are able to see my firearm. But anyway, that's the upgrade, that's the update, new stuff in. I am about to eat my goulash hamburger helper. And uh, I know it's been a while, but here you go, something new. I catch up with you.